Welcome back, YouTube. It is Two Point Joe, and we are coming back with, I think, our first max raid battle ever. Um, first on the channel. We have done a few, but I just never really thought of showing them. Um, it is New Year's Eve as of recording, so I hope you guys are having a blessed New Year's. This won't go up probably for a week or so, but in the meantime. I hope it's been going well. Anyways, guys, cue that intro. I'll be right back. That intro always, you know, is just relaxing. It's so chilled. But anyways, last episode, we fought Nessa, the second gym leader, the water type gym master. And in this video, we're going to talk to the chairman and then start making our way. Um, I believe it is Galler Mines that we're headed to next. And we should have a rival fight, I presume. We haven't fought Hop in a while. But we're going to fight someone, I have a feeling. Um, and, you know, then we'll just kind of call it after that. So, hope you guys enjoy. And the max raid battles, real quick. Some of them are super easy, like this one. But some of them are ridiculously hard. Like, whenever they start putting up their shields, it's ridiculous. Like the 5 star, um, not on this account, but on another, I have played. The 5 star max raids are almost impossible. Um, depending on the team that you're using, like, even using super effective, um, just the shields are ridiculous. Like, playing with AI, they're so dumb to play with. But anyways, we took this one out fairly easy, and yeah, get some goodies. Just wanted to show that real quick, um, just because I never have on the channel. So, that's that. If you guys have never seen it. You're welcome, and if you've never seen it, then you probably don't follow Pokemon, and I thank you guys for watching my channel. So anyways, um, let's, might as well use some of these that we just got, just to show you can get XP, so it's not completely worthless, um, but it is something fun to kind of pass the time, because that took, what, two minutes, and you can get a level or two depending on um, what level the max rate itself is so anyways let's start progressing through the story we have to meet the chairman whatever his name is I forget um, and then his assistant at some coffee shop I believe some donut coffee shop right here um, I hope I didn't keep them waiting because they said like after the gym you know, just to come over and we'll celebrate it. Rose. Don't know how I forgot that. And then Sonya's here, so that's that's neat. Oh, you two know each other? Why, yes. Yes, we do. Homie looks so interesting all the time. Like, he looks like the, you know, principal who's, like, trying to be hip. Like, he's, like, trying to fit in with the kids. What is up with that haircut? Good lord. I can't not focus on that right now. Anyways. Don't really think we need to know what's going on right here. It's just talking about... There's um, some power spot that... Is emitting Dynamax something. Um... And since Sonya is the only one who really knows anything in the whole region, she's the one who should look after it. And, uh, looks like they're already leaving. Alright, cool. Homie's got interesting facial hair as well. Nice swimsuit shorts. Okay. He's right, the vault would be a good place. You got the water badge, yeah? Here's a TN. Retaliate. Interesting. 
I wish that she gave us a TM every gym that we beat. Ness is a good friend. Perhaps I should drop in. Until your next gym challenge. What if I quit right now? What if we never see each other again? Alright, mate. Do we fight him right here? Um, fire gym is next. Cool. Um, our starter Pokemon should sweep that for sure. If we zip right over there. Putting the brakes on something. Yep, go through the Galar Mine. Okay. Guess we don't fight Hop just yet. I kind of figured we would. At this pace, we've been fighting him all the time. Um, didn't mean to open up the menus, but, you know, whatever. Looks like Team Yell finally moved. So we can finally get in here. The last mine was kind of long. I wonder how long this will be. Don't really want to... Oh, of course. Didn't want to fight these guys. And I knew that there was going to be a trainer. Well, I guess this is our rival fight. I feel sorry for my Pokemon if I ever... I'm not in the mood. Alright, come on, hurry up. I don't care. This dude, like, talks so much trash. He's like, I don't want my Pokemon to fight yours because they're so weak. You want to fight? That's like, bead. Come on. He just thinks that he's better than everyone. Um, I don't know why. Solosis. Who do we have out? Squirt. Alright. So, we have a brand new move, Sucker Punch. But, I don't know. Is it worth it? Is he going to attack us? He is. That did decent damage. Looks like you've grown a bit. Only a little bit, though. Psy Shock. We could take that for sure. Wow. That did quite a bit. Super Potion. Good thing I didn't use that Sucker Punch. Anyways, guys. You do anything for New Year's? I hope that it was productive. I hope that you guys had a blast. And I hope it was safe. Most importantly, that's what matters. But also, what matters. So you guys should subscribe, like the video, and share it to your friends. Because, I mean, you know, we're all just trying to help each other out here. I would appreciate it. But anyways, um, I was noticing that... Rookity, uh, this this dude's first form. He has some fantastic moves to begin with. For example, what we're going to do real quick. Um, Hone Claws ups attack and accuracy, which gives you two stab boosts. And then Power Trip, um, I believe it's like 20 damage. It might be a little bit more. Um, but it's per stab boost that you have. So, you use Hone Claws twice, you're technically at plus four. And, again, 20 sounds a little bit low. Might be 25, but still, Power Trip is a fantastic move, because, you know, for each stat boost that you have, it increases the damage. So, hopefully, we could just one-shot. And it's super effective. Overall... This dude is, he's probably one of the best, like, early bird Pokemon that you get. He turns into Steel-type, which is super cool. Um, and again, he can set up, he just gets really powerful. Like, I'm probably going to keep those two moves for a long time. Probably Hone Claws forever. Power Trip, I don't know, it's... It can be situational, because if you don't use Hone Claws, then Power Trip becomes worthless. Um, but still, you know, he took those two out kind of with ease. Pony to... Let's see. It's always a weird Pokemon. Like, I forget that he's not the fire Ponyta for some reason. He's faster than us? Wow. Oh, this could go horrible. Okay, good. Good. That was that was almost bad. Still. This dude surprised at how good he is. Dang. That was decent XP. 
Thanks, Speed. I guess you did one thing useful. Eldegoss. Kind of forgot he was on the team, not going to lie. Um, probably going to switch him out sooner or later. But, again, we'll see. We'll see. Got Bede's League card. Hmm. Alright. That's that. That's basically all I wanted to do. I know that was super short. So we'll keep going a little bit farther. Um, <clears throat> let's, let's see. We'll do what? One, two more fights. Call it after that. Um, I don't want this to be too short because I know I've been averaging about like 18 minutes. Um, but again, I feel like slightly shorter videos for Pokemon is better because as long as it's not like a gym challenge or something large of that sort. Um, what is this? Homie's going to take us out. I don't know why I clicked on that. I figured it'd tell me a little bit more. But again, as I was saying, something... Wow, that was quick. Something a little bit shorter. Might be a little bit better. I don't know. What do you guys want to see? Um, and I'll try to adapt. Do you guys like longer videos or, you know, a little bit shorter or kind of what I have been doing? Let me know. That would be greatly appreciated. If we don't catch this dude, I'll give it two more. Okay. One more, and then we should run. Right? You know what? I was thinking... And, uh... I really... I just didn't want him to die. So again, risking it... It just wasn't worth it. Whatever. Corva Squire can probably just maul everything. I mean, this dude probably is a rock, which I didn't think of. And I think Corva Squire is flying and just pure flying. But part of me wants to say dark. Um, <clears throat> I don't know. This dude is fire and rock. Right? We'll find out. Yes, that was not very effective. Rapid spin. That's the best move this dude has. We could stay in, for sure. Because I don't know why he wouldn't have gone for anything else if he had it. But I guess we'll find out right here. Rapid spin. Alright, no, we're good. We're golden. Let's see how much this does. Ancient power? Oh, okay, so he does have something else. Wow. So he was just trying to go and outspeed us, I see. Wow. That really didn't do much at all. And we didn't even heal up Squirt. Okay. Um, this dude should be able to tank an ancient power. I smack down. All right. Rock move. No big deal. Let's see. Hmm. Super concerned because I just kind of forgot. This dude was fire type. Flame charge. Yeah. Yeah. Figures. Okay. Good. We could. We we took it. This dude just keeps increasing his speed. That move looks pretty cool. That's the only reason why I really changed it up. Alright, so... We definitely need to think. What do we want to do next? But anyways, guys. I'm going to call it there. Hope you guys enjoyed. This is Two Point Show. Signing out. Catch you on the next one. Peace.